Hey guys, just a side note. I tried to upload this um, like 9 o'clock in the morning or 12 in the afternoon uh, GMT my time. But sometimes I forget, but hopefully, yes. This one, since it's 8.51 right now, might be uploaded a tiny bit after 9, but I still classify that as sort of 9, so that's when I'll upload it if I get it edited and finished before then. Anyway, on to the main part. Welcome to Shout Out Sunday, number 41. Um, so as always, a huge thank you to those who commented consistently and who have subscribed recently. Though right now, there is 23 subscribers to go until I hit 500. So that's exciting. Sorry if I don't sound excited. Um, yeah, it's just my voice. Um, so, really excited for that. Only 23. Though there was like minus 6 and minus 4. Um, or minus four in the last week. But anyway, let's get on with the show, shall we? So these three people have commented this month. So technically one only commented once, but he features my channel in his videos. So I thought I might as well add his because he does awesome artwork, well, speed art, and lovely pack openings and you know who I'm talking about you know who you are and well well since I did that intro I might as well start with him uh Getty Images very awesome speed art because like one of his dragon arts are really epic like really cool um my lovely friend Juin commented on I think almost every single video this month, which is awesome. So really, thank you. It does mean a lot. And Pokecardex has come back. <laughs> it's been a while. Um, let's see. Now, from the people that I bought slash one from recently. Um, can't remember which one it was that I won from. Because I'm still waiting for, I think, three giveaways to actually arrive here. So, <laughs> I can't quite remember, but, yeah. <laughs> okay, so, first up, we've got Sleepy Snorlax X. Lovely friend, do check her out on her Instagram. All By the way, all links are in the description box below, so you can find them easier. Um, next up is Cherry Wallace, which I bought her... Powered by Geek Gear, which is the link below. Her um, curation of Magical Curiosities Christmas um, Maximus Edition box, which is so exciting. I I do love them. <clears throat> so far, she's only done two subscription boxes, and in the past, she did do three pins. Though I am interested to see if she does any more, because as you know by now, I'm sort of obsessed with buying pins at the moment. So I need to start buying some more Pokemon cards. I've gone a bit lax with that. <laughs> but I do have to save up for getting a laptop of myself. So I'll have to cut down on buying things soon. <laughs> I think that'll happen. Okay. Um, so next person is Sumai. Is that how you say your name? Well, it's two underscores, then, you know, X U I M. A I. She ha she does lovely, lovely pins. Absolutely awesome. And some other stuff too, I think. But it's mainly pins. Okay, next one is Candarella nineteen. She mainly by the looks of it did does BTS pins, but the pin I bought from her, obviously as you saw in the video if you watched it, was the card captors. Sakura and Sharon, uh love connection um, double pin thing with the chain in the middle. Yeah, that's awesome. Very pretty. Um, next one is Zichan 04, or she changed her um, designs. One to um, Dream Demoiselle. She 
they've got awesome pins. I mean, so far they've only done really two. Two designs and one that was on pre-order. But they're going to start a Kickstarter that are... Um, I think we called it a Magical Girl Kickstarter or something. But anyway, it does have very... They do have very beautiful designs. Next up is Arisa Chibara. And awesome pins, yeah. Just awesome. She's got... Um, she does quite a few Kickstarters as well as pre-orders, and like she's got some washi tape, luggage tags, acrylic stands, acrylic charms, um, pillow charms, body pillows I think too, and notebooks. Loads of stuff. Do go check her out. Awesome, awesome artwork. Just, just plain awesome. Um, Mayunbi. I think that's how you say it. She did those lovely Sailor Moon crystal, um, crystal heart uh, pins from that Kickstarter. That is really pretty. Um, then there's, well, I can say Jenkin Creative, but it's now, it's now a Kodama Creative. Awesome. Those were the, um, what's it called? Acrylic pins, which was really cool. Um, never had acrylic pins before, so that was cool. Um, next is, I put this person in because it was kind of confusing for me, because they had the same kind of pictures, because like, that could be their other account, or it could be a separate account, because of that, this name, Mackie Moonco, was on the backing card of Kodama Creative pins from that Kickstarter, so I was a bit confused, so I just put the both down on the list anyway. Next up, we have my lovely friend, Junkin Kuji, or on YouTube, it's Junkin, Junkin Play. She does lovely, uh, what would you call them? Kuji drawing videos, and some other arcade-like videos. And recently did a gift exchange for Christmas. So she did a, vi did a video of that. And I did a video of what she got me. As you probably saw on the uh, what I got for Christmas video. So yeah. Awesome friend. Lovely to buy from. Lovely prices to buy from. Just absolutely all around lovely. And lastly, by no means least. Is Ada... Goods Pickup. She does have another one, which is Pins Trader. She does make pins too, but I haven't bought any of her pins yet. But I do plan on doing at least some once, at least. She has lovely, lovely Disney. And mainly I follow for the aerial pins because I love Little Mermaid. But yes. <clears throat> so that is it, I believe. Um, so, obviously, if you want to be mentioned, you either comment at least twice between now and next month, when the next month's video will be on the 26th of January. Um, or you just comment below asking for a shout out and I'll add you to the list. No problems. Um, and if you're picky, I can shout out your YouTube channel or other social media like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snaps, etc, etc. Um, normally don't point, point this out, but um, since it, you don't have to, obviously. But if you'd like to send me fan mail or just like a card, letter, anything really, uh, you can ask for my address on the email below. I'd love to hear from you. Um, you can also donate on the uh, PayPal link below as well. Not necessary. Would help out. But on the same topic, you can also buy from my eBay. I have loads and loads of items on there. Um, if you want, and you don't really want to go on eBay, 
and but still have PayPal, you can buy. You can look on、uh, eBay and buy from me by contacting me on my Instagram. I'll sell that cheaper on Instagram because there's no eBay fees or whatever to contend with. But if you want it cheaper, just ask about it on my Instagram on a DM, and we will work something out. Um, is that it? I don't think there's anything really to talk about. Any news? News. Um. Let's see. There's obviously no Akibento. Um. I already talked about eBay. Um. I'm still waiting for at least two Wizarding World subscription boxes. Uh. There will no be no. A Sokawi box, January. Ah.、Oh. Um, the Pokemon Go Community Day thing has not been announced yet, and it would also be helpful. I don't know how long、um, it will stay on Amazon because my mom really does deal with that. But there is a book that my mother and I wrote called "Where in the World Is Wales." So that's basically kind of from my point of view. Type of geography slash history slash biology. I'm not biology. Um, biography. That's the word. <laughs> sort of. It's educational, kind of tiny bit out of date because some of the money has changed by now. But I do have a playlist, which is only one video, of me reading the synopsis. So do check it out if you're interested. It's. Not much, I don't think. So, and the links to the Amazon digital or paperback versions are in the link in the description box of that video. So, I think that's it. Oh, it's only been twelve minutes. Well, twelve and a half minutes. So, I think that's everything. So, thank you for watching. Like, subscribe for more. Hit over for notifications. Over and out.